Bashcock Funk here, and we are about to bring it up, y'all. This is Chicago Beef, which is gonna bring your dining experience up a level. Easy to make it at home, this is a famous sandwich, of course, from the city of Chicago. The Italian beef is a slowly braised, slow roasted chuck roast that has a bunch of flavors that just really can't be replicated. We're gonna show you how to make it at home so you don't have to spend all day at your stovetop. Now, the base of this sandwich, what we want you to do is to get a, between a three and five pound chuck roast, right? In a cast iron skillet, salt and pepper all over it and sear it on all sides. Then you're gonna stick it into a crock pot. Now, in the crock pot, what we've already done is we put in the following ingredients, you ready? One 12 ounce can of Coca-Cola, not Diet Coke, not New Coke, not sugar-free Coke, the original, Coca-Cola, all right? Two 16 ounce containers of beef broth, one bay leaf, a couple tablespoons of dried minced onion, a couple tablespoons of garlic powder, onion powder, a quarter cup of soy sauce, a quarter cup of Worcestershire sauce, and then let that kind of simmer, and we cooked it on low for 10 hours. If it's done right, it's gonna be falling apart like that, but still sliceable, and that's what we want. But this, that, is how the Chicago beef has gotta look for y'all. Now there's different ways you can have it served. You can get the bread wet or dry or half wet. Wet is when you dip the whole thing into the broth. That's when you need a sturdy roll. But we're gonna go half wet on it, so we're only gonna dip half of it. In and out real quick. From there, we're gonna slice our beef. So when you see it, it's gonna to start to come apart in these beautiful shreds like that. Um, and when you're in Chicago and it's been braised in the stove, they'll use it through a deli slicer sometimes, but this is even better and more tender. So we've got all this flavor on there. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna layer that across our base of our sandwich. Now we've got it looking pretty right and tight in there. One of the things I gotta tell you about Chicago is Alex and our crew, uh, we like to party a little bit, and Chicago is one of our favorite places to go. We've had an incredible culinary adventure there. We had a limo that Alex tried to commandeer and steal and take to Wisconsin, but that's a story for another time. Now let's get to the traditional toppings. So both of these we got from our friends at Epicuse. The first is Jardinia, which is a mix of pickled cauliflowers, carrots, that type of stuff. But what we did was we took it out already and minced up four pepperoncinis and put it back in there. So we've got a little bit of a hot mix. So when you order it hot, this is what you get on top of it. So we're gonna layer that on top of all this beautiful beefy goodness, right? And also too, it creates a good little temperature change. You get the cool topping, the, the warm roast beef, and then you can also get it sweet. And what the sweet is, or with peppers, um, sometimes they're sauteed sweet green Italian peppers, but we're gonna use roasted red peppers because we like how the color looks. And of all the selections that you see around town, Epicuse has one that really brings it the right way. Oh man, look at this fabulous sandwich. Now, we're gonna take it from the wet end because we like to bite that area a lot, and here's where we're gonna get down with it. Take a big, beautiful mouthful. From Chicago with love, Spashcock Funk. <laughs>